Okay, hey guys, I'm just gonna talk to you about what is in the 3U physics kits that you would have received on your doorstep in the last day or two. Um, and just as a reminder, those are free, like they don't cost anything, they're just uh, some tools for success when we're doing online learning. So uh, first you'll find in there is a whiteboard, a whiteboard marker and a sock as your eraser. Um, those work great as a non-permanent surface just as a safe place to try all your solutions and stuff like that. I got the skinny markers so they should fit nicely on here. Um, so that is for you to work through solutions and get through ideas if you have a high idea generation. Uh, for ideas, you also have sticky notes. So these can be reminders to yourself of things to remember to do. These can be reminders about things you want to remember like content, or they can just be like, if we're going through brainstorm ideas, then you can write a bunch of ideas down and do it that way. Um, in physics, it involves a lot of measuring. And so you have an Ikea paper meter stick ready to go thanks to Ikea. Um, and so uh, inches on one side, centimeters on the other. Most of the time you'll be in metric and centimeters, but those are there for you for when we do different activities. Speaking of activities, uh, you'll find a couple of different things. So for one thing, you'll find a bunch of these little sugar packets. These are great for marking position as you move along. You can also use sticky notes to replace the sugar packets after you've moved to make sure that they don't move after you're down in measuring and stuff like that. So you can always put those down instead there. You'll find some form of tape to help hold things together as we go through the course. You'll find different types of balls. So most kits will have two bouncy balls and two marbles, and those are for uh, rolling and dropping. So we can use them to roll down ramps or across surfaces. We can also drop them to do energy calculations. So those are great for comparison's sake there. You'll find some straws. Uh, we're going to use these to make a musical instrument later um, and so because music is in our curriculum so you'll need some straws for that stuff. Uh, you have string of some form. So this string and this is for making pendulums so we can swing back and forth and look at patterns with periodic motion. You'll find some elastic bands in different colors and sizes and shapes and those will be good for measuring forces and kind of just exploring the world of pulls and pushes which is forces you'll find some other things like paper clips and clothespins these are just for holding things so for example like when you're making your pendulum you may need to like hold it together somehow or or somehow attach it so these are just kind of attachment tools these also work really well uh, when you've got a paper clip um, because sometimes it's hard to pull on an elastic evenly. So if you kind of just wiggle your paper clip through your elastic band, then it just gives you a nice place to pull and a nice even place to pull just to keep things a bit more consistent. Uh, you will find some toy cars if you wanted to roll these down. Now these aren't very um, good cars, so they, they're not, they have a lot of friction, so I wouldn't use them very often, but they're fun, so there's cars for you. Um, there is a piece of chalk so if you need to mark like a start and finish position on your floor, uh, white chalk really gently down means that your parents or guardians or whoever owns your house isn't going to freak out when you draw on the floor or your table to mark like a starting position and a final position because um, chalk comes up. So that's why there's chalk there. Also, if you decide you want to get outside and do the labs outside because they're beautiful outside, then you can use these to mark your positions of where things are. And then last but not least, uh, candy because we all need candy. And uh, yeah, so if you have any questions or concerns, let me know, but I just want to let you know that that's what's in the bins and we'll use all those things over the course of this year.